Hey guys, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how you can get into Tinkercad, which is www.tinkercad.com. This is a program that you can use to create 3D drawings and you can print them out using a 3D printer. Now to get started, we're going to click Sign In. Sign in using social providers because we're going to use our school email address to get in and we're going to use Google. Okay, and I'm going to use my student account and just wait a few moments and let's get past this screen. All right, and this is what we get. So first thing we want to do is create a new design. So we click create new design. and you'll have an interface that looks like this. Now, I would recommend that if you use this program, you get a mouse for your computer. Uh, you don't use a phone and you don't use a tablet. You should be using uh, a computer with a mouse for this program. Now, uh, if I use the scroll button on my mouse, I can zoom in and zoom out on the canvas. This is where our 3D models are going to be. So on the right-hand side, you can see I can put a box I just drag a box using my mouse. I can zoom in. I can make the box long. I can make the box short. I can hold the right mouse button and I can rotate around the canvas. I can also stretch this. I can also lift this above the ground. You know it's above the ground because of the shadow that it leaves. But we want to put this down on the surface like that. You can also add other shapes, like a sphere, like a ball shape. You can also add uh, text as well. So if you want to type something, you can, well, we're going to rotate that. So just give us a moment. You can just want to change the angle. Oops, excuse me. All right, let's rotate this. I'm going to rotate it so it's like that. Okay, and then rotate back. We're going to move this, and then on the uh, right-hand side, you can change the word text into something. So you could put, for example, uh, and put my last name, change the font. Notice how the style of the writing looks different now that I've changed the font. Change the height, change the bevel. Like it gets really thick when you do that. Well, you can see all these different tools do different things, and you can also change the color. Keep in mind, if you use a 3D printer, you're probably only going to be printing with one color. So even if you use all these different colors, you're only going to use one color, especially at uh, Lorting Pong Secondary School. All right, so... All right, that's just the basic of how to use the Tinkercad to make 3D pictures. So thank you for watching, and see you soon.